counts, and uh, this one is an all or nothing. It's a playoffs. Chuck Dolan, Bill Belichick. Ten Super Bowls between them, ten Super Bowl wins. Belichick with six, Noel with four. And it's really, when you look at this, it is a, this is something, it's, I'll tell you what, this is one of those games that, you know, you want to count out Pittsburgh, but don't. Because Chuck Dole and company already beat this team 1914. And Chuck Dole is great at winning games he's not supposed to. Look at 1989, where Bill Belichick, again, the 2016 Patriots, not the strongest Patriot team. This was the one that uh, was down 28-3 in the Super Bowl and ended up winning the game. So Gillette Stadium, Pittsburgh, and New England. And now for our national anthem here at Gillette Stadium. <laughs> So that is it, the national anthem, and we're ready to go. New England and Pittsburgh. And the Steelers will kick off, and we're underway here at Gillette Stadium, a clear day. A deep kickoff, and here comes Adam And the ball in the end zone, returning this up to the 30, and to the 31 yard line, to the 32. And it'll be a first down for New England. Tom Brady now. He's going to be the quarterback for New England. They go to Brown and they go to Brown. Second down. And they'll get about five, second and five. Very, very solid team, both these teams. Not really a real weakness, except the Steelers kicking. They got the turn, Edelman, and Edelman is running. He's down to the 25. So all the way down to the 25, 38 yards. They burn. Uh, Wagner, Mike Wagner, and it'll be first down. So New England is all the way down. It'll be first down, Brady. Here we go. I think it'll be second down and 11. Second down and 11. Here we go. Up the middle, and it's going to be third down and eight. Third and eight. Brady. It's a touchdown. Oh my touchdown. goodness, right down the field. And Brady Edelman, and all of a sudden it's six to nothing New England. Well, I will tell you what, five plays, 68 yards, three minutes. But Kagoskowski again, it's going to be up, it's over. And it is good, and it's so good. Early on, incredible. And to the 9, to the 10, here's Maxson. Up to the 20, to the 21. First down and 10 for the Steelers now. Down 7 to nothing. They won the last game, 1914. Bradshaw, and he's going to, and it's incomplete. Second down. He tried to hit Smith, and it's second down. Second down and 10. And they're Rocky Blyer, and he's going to hit it. It'll be third and manageable. Early on, New England, what a first drive, and that's going to be a flag. 
And a penalty, it'll be third and 11. The Steelers only played one AFC Championship game on the road. Liar. And during the 1970s, he gets eight. But it's not going to be enough. It'll be fourth and three, and now they're going to kick it back. In the Super Bowl years, they only played one road game. When you look at it, the years they won the Super Bowl, up to the 27. The Steelers played one road game, and that was 74 against New England. First down and 10. Brady. Brady, a longer throw again, incomplete. and incomplete. It'll be second, second down. down. Well, they got it early, and they got a little bit greedy here. Second down, Brady again. He's going to throw on the pressure. Incomplete. incomplete again. Third down. It'll be third down and 10. It's a little, little less out of an offense now. And again, he gets that thing, and the Steelers will get it back. Well, they went all the way down the field and scored the first time. Allen, oh, it's going to be up, and he doesn't get to it. It's going to be back to the 21. Field. Well, no return on a 22. So here come the Steelers, first down and 10. Bradshaw. The throw, the throw, he slipped and fell. It looked like it'll be second and 10. Nothing going for the Steelers early now. A lot of incompletes. Bradshaw is going to escape and run. And Bradshaw, Bradshaw gets a first, first down. down. Out of bounds. So Bradshaw has it again of 15. And the Steelers again. Again, they're going to throw. He throws it deep and incomplete. He almost had it. It'll be second down and 10. Second down and 10s. New England seven and up the Raiders. And finally a catch, they get half of it back. It'll be third down and five. Bradshaw, they get to Franco. Fumble, and Franco fumbles. The first time in over 230 carries he fumbled. And New England got it. He had 230 some carries without a fumble. And now let's end it and New England gets it. Oh my goodness, a big turnover, Brady. Brady to throw, and it's caught by Edelman in the first down. first down. So New England will be first down and 10. Halfway through the first quarter, Brady again. They throw right to Blount. Here comes again, and he gets seven. Second down. Out of be bounds. second down and three. This thing is shaping up early to be very good for New England. Brady again to the first down. First down. My goodness, they're using the run and the pass. They're using it equally well. Brady again. They hand it to White. Oh, and the Steelers get it back. A huge turnover rarity for New England. Oh, rarity, a New England turnover. Usually they score on them. And the Steelers will get it back. New England fumbles the football. And it's going to be first down and 10. My goodness, 7 to nothing, New England. Yes. Second down. And Franco gets to it. It'll be second down. Oh, two turnovers. A fumble by the Patriots and a, fum a fumble by the Steelers, a fumble by the Patriots. Second down, Bradshaw. You get to Franco, nothing there. It'll be third and eight. It's concerning if you're the Steelers. You can't get noticeable running, running yardage on this New England defense. Bradshaw, and they still knock out a first down. It's going to be fourth and eight, and now they're going to punt. Once in his career, and he beat him. That was Chuck Dole's last game. Actually, beat him, they beat him twice. They played him twice. Chuck Dole beat Bill Belichick in his last game. I'm not sure if they beat him earlier. The Steelers ended up 9-7 uh, and seven his last year. Hogan. Second down. Be second down and five. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to check on that. Second down and five. Brady. Lewis. Third down. It'll be third down and three. Labor with the stop. Three and a half to go. Brady, nobody getting any long uh, drives. Edelman gets a first down. He turned away. He came back. It'll be first down and 10. Under three minutes to go. Brady. And Bennett will catch that. It'll be second and seven. Well, the Steelers have been giving up a lot of yards to New England. Brady to get a miss, and it's going to be third down. down and seven. Clock is ticking a minute 46. Brady. There's White, and White nothing going, and now they're going to have to punt. So 
It's going to be fourth down and five, a minute and 15 to go, 75 seconds. Here in the first, and Allen is going to kick to the near side, and this thing goes out of bounds. Seven to nothing. A minute and nine to go, Bradshaw. And it's going to be incomplete. Wow, this is two very good football teams, teams of certain decades, and right now, it's at the oh, it's intercepted. Ryan is running the wrong way, and it's intercepted. So Bradshaw threw the interception. Ryan started to run the wrong way, and what a bizarre play that was. A really bizarre play, and here comes New England. My goodness, Brady now, and they hand it to Brock. It's going to be second and seven. What a bizarre play that was. That was strange. We'll have to look at that again. It's going to be second down. Brady to hand the ball up the middle. It's going to be third down and three. That's going to end the first quarter. The score, New England seven, Pittsburgh nothing. So, I mean, the New England has been dominating everything. They can't really run the football, but passing, they're doing really well. Bradshaw has no rating, as he has a rating of zero. It's like he didn't exist. It's like he snapped the ball and put it on an orange cone. The Steelers already have two turnovers, three total combined for the game for both teams. So on a third down and three, here's Brady to begin the second quarter. And it's incomplete. Goskowski might try a 49-yarder. Let's see, it's going to make it 10 to nothing here. 49, Buffalo holds. and it's way short. It is short. short. And it is going to be first down for the Steelers. From the 39, very short. Still 7 to nothing, and here comes first down for Pittsburgh. That's going to throw. They throw Rocky Blyer down to the middle. Second down. Down to the near side. Sorry, it's going to be second and three. Second and three now. The Steelers run, pass reception, and first Harris, down. and that's going to be a first down. That might be their first first down. Let's take a look at game stats and know their second first down. Harris, first down and ten. Midfield, Bradshaw, and the quick throw to Stallworth, who gets it. It'll be second down and two. So the Steelers have never sinned well, and that's going to start with the first down in the Spencer Kale League. They made the semifinals and got blown out by the Patriots, the 64 Patriots. Franco, Franco gets uh, three. It'll be second and seven. Of course, they played in Fenway Park in Boston. Second down and seven. Red down, down he goes. So that kills that, and Roy Jarella is not a good kicker. He's not a good kicker at all. It'll be third down and 14. That shot and down he goes. It's going to be fourth and 20. Twice he gets sacked. And not good for a Steeler offensive line. Remember the 78 Steelers were, um, they were a small offensive line. They are very finesse. But when you're pass blocking, that can be tough. Even though they passed well in 78. It'll be first down and 10. Brady, the blitz is on, the throw is complete. It'll be second down and 10, they had everybody coming. Second down, Donnie Shell with the defense. Brady, they go to Lewis, and again, third down. It'll be third down and eight. Under 10 minutes to go here in the second. Brady, a new throw, the throw to the near side, it's incomplete. Fourth down. And it's gonna be fourth down and eight, and now they're gonna kick. Fourth down and eight. It's going to be a deeper kick. 
the 40 to the 45, up to the 47. First down and 10, New England leads Pittsburgh seven to nothing. 9.26, Bradshaw. Right. He's gonna get a couple, it'll be second down and eight. Second down and eight, under nine minutes to go, Bradshaw. He's gonna throw, and he goes to Bradshaw. It'll be third down and six. At least they're getting positive yardage if you're a Steeler fan. They're getting territory, too, but they're not finishing. Bradshaw, that's incomplete. And now they're gonna have to punt it back. Man alive, a lot of the Steelers rolled in 78. Bradshaw would have like 50% completion in a game. And it's gonna be out of bounds at their own six yard line. And pushing New England back, Brady on a first down. He's gonna throw it out of bounds. Here's the thing about New England. They're doing nothing now, but you gotta worry about the two minute drill. Second down, Brady to the middle of the game, the first down and more. He's gonna get 12, it'll be first and 10. Man alive, if they can hold this till the two minute warning, they'd be great. Yeah. Yeah. Going. It'll be second and 11. Seven and nothing, New England. Brady again to throw, and he throws, it's caught by Hogan. Third down, out of bounds. All the way down to the 27, all the way up, I should say. And it'll be third down and two. Brady and the Steelers. With a good defensive stop here, it'll be fourth down and two, and now they're gonna punt. And again, they're putting their hands up, and they just want to block that one. Here we go. Yeah. And he only gets a couple up to the 26. So here come the Steelers. They had one good drive all day, and it's stalled with two sacks. That shot is down. be second down and seven. They're doing the old two minute. They're doing the old West Coast offense. Throw for three. Franco. It's going to be third and five. Remember, they won the last match of 1914, but again, the regular season, that was all neutral sites. Bradshaw. Incomplete. Nothing but the near side. It's fourth and five, and now they're going to have to punt. He's had an ugly, ugly second quarter. First half is the ugly. And, and it's going to be a punt and uh, New England territory, and Amendola gets one. So first down for Brady. I'd run it twice, get to the warning, and then we'll go. Brady to right, second, second down. down and five. That's the really big part about getting a first down here. Second and five, Brady to the near side, and incomplete, it'll be third, third down. down. Third down and five, 2.48 to go, Brady. Down. It'll be fourth down and six, and now they're going to have to punt it back, really, for the Steelers. They're going to have the ball past the uh, two-minute warning. They're going to have it for the rest of the half. And here's the ball up to the 30, to the 31. I'll tell you what, it's going to be 205. Bradshaw. Bradshaw is going to fire it, and it is incomplete. That's going to be a two-minute warning. Two minutes. New England seven, Pittsburgh nothing. And I'm telling you what, right now, the Steelers not looking that great. They're looking ugly. They got to thank their lucky stars. New England's drives have stalled. But New England can't run the football. They have no rushing yards in this quarter. Second down and 10 for the Steelers. Bradshaw. And he's going to throw down the middle of the field. And he's going to sideline incomplete. Third down. He's done nothing all day. It's going to be third and 10. So, Stallworth and Swan have been neutralized. Third down, Bradshaw's getting time. Caught by Smith on the first down and more. Down to the 35 and the 34. He's getting time, now he is. Chung with the tackle, he was sacked and beat around early, but he got time the last few throws. And now they're gonna hurry to the line, Bradshaw now. The throw, and he will throw, and it's incomplete. Second it's second down. down. It feels like a 
Steeler Patriot game, but a new one. It feels like a new one. Bradshaw. Throw to the near side. Still worth in the first down. first down. You know, a new one feels like New England's blowing you out, but it still feels like a close score. The only exception was the 2001 AFC title game. The Steelers hurrying to the line. A minute and four to go. Bradshaw. They move. It's going to be on New England. And New England. It was Bradshaw. And he goes down, down. but it's going to be on New bound. England. They jumped off sides. And it'll be first down and five. Under a minute to go. They have all three timeouts. 56 seconds. Bradshaw. Oh, he goes down there. They get the sack anyway of 10. It'll be second and 15. And the Steelers call time. Second and 15, Bradshaw. And look at him run. He does something. My goodness. They're not getting anything here. It'll be third and 17. One more timeout. Bradshaw will be 36 from this point. The throw, middle of the field, incomplete. Wow, did they butcher that? Did they absolutely butcher that? And now Jarella. Jarella, a long field goal of 46. Bishop will hold. It is up over and from 46. The Steelers will make it. Thirty-two seconds, and New England has a seven to three lead. So the Steelers get a field goal, even though offensively they're really struggling. And then they're up to the thirty-four. You look at the stats; you say it'd be a New England blowout, but let's see. Can you do something in twenty-five seconds? Williams famous for this, and there's no good, but he's not famous for that. It's going to be under twenty seconds of timeout. 20 seconds to go. They got five and most. Brady and incomplete. It'll be Third second down. down. There's a penalty. And it's going to be holding. They're pushing him back. Second down and 15. 15 seconds to go. Brady. They go to block. And Third nothing. Down. He gets out of bounds. Third and 17. Nine seconds to go. Brady. Quick throw. And go. Look at him. Go. Down to the 44. And they're going to have one more timeout, and they're going to one more play. Oh, if they score here, typical New England. Brady goes down, and that's it. Elsie Greenwood said, no way you're throwing this. He gets through. And at the end of one half, the score New England seven, the Steelers three. It's because the drives have stalled. Third down conversions, it has not been happening for New England. New England with negative two rushing yards in that quarter. The Steelers are stopping the run. They're really stuffing it. Their front four is incredible. And New England with four sacks. They sacked Bradshaw four times, and Goskowski will kick off to the Steelers. Seven to three. Let's see what happens here. They're not a good return team. Anderson. Anderson. They get a good one here. A solid one. Up to the 32, and it'll be first down. 7 to 3. New England leads Pittsburgh. Trips, and they get the Brian. Brian, a first down, and look at him run up to the 49. So it'll be a first down for the Steelers. Up to the 49. Bradshaw, Harrison, Wire. Bradshaw fakes to Harris. He throws to the near side. Oh, he got stolen with throw. Was this First all game? Down. And it's going to be 29 yards down to the 22. But remember, New England started out the same way. They ended up with seven. Bradshaw first down. Bradshaw to the near side. Again, Stolworth. It'll be second and five. This is the way it's going. Second down and five. Bradshaw to the Harris. Third down. Up the middle, third and three. Third down and three, New England. 
And we paid in here comes Ray Joella. Ray Joella is going to try and make it seven to six. a decision, Chuck Dole, it's, you know, the 1970s decision, it was always, um, the question was always, you know, the philosophy in the 70s was, you never ever take points off the scoreboard. And that's what Chuck Dole does with Jones. And Jones up to the 35. Because what if you turn it over, then you got nothing after you had points. First down and 10, but they were close. Brady a deep drop, he's gonna throw it deep, and Ogan a first down and more. At 39, it'll be first down and 10. First down, New England, they're driving now. Brady, a deep drop, throw it in, and incomplete, it'll be second down. Negative two yards rushing, 22 in the first, negative two in the second. Brady again, he's just throwing it every down, Edelman. Third down. It'll be third down and short, 47 from this point. Third down and one. Brady to Deion Lewis, a first down. First down. So Lewis from University of Pittsburgh. And LeGarrette Blount, I believe, both, I don't know. Lewis to the near side. Lewis down first to the down. 14 and a gain of 12. New England is driving the ball very well. They might get back this field goal very quickly. Brady, and to the near side, touchdown, Edelman! Touchdown. Well, they've been pushed in the first possession of the second half. They go right down the field in three minutes and three seconds. Six plays, 65 yards. And the extra point from Goskowski, it's good. My goodness, we have New England tomorrow. It's the 2007 Patriots against the 86 Giants. the same field, and Maxson, that's not good. It's up to the 13, not a great return. First down and 10, 8.48 to go, Bradshaw. We get to Franco, Franco up to the 20. A gain of seven. Well, they gotta get this running game going if you're the Steelers. Bradshaw play action. No throw and incomplete. Third down. Wow, that makes third down a lot harder when you know what's coming. Oh, it's gonna be a pass. And it's got the field down on the first down. First down. Well, I'll tell you what, Swan and Stallworth have been occupying the defenders. They're making Bell and uh, Smith do all the work. Bell and Smith. And they go to Lynn Swan here, and it's a first down and more down to the 42. This has become a basketball game now. Up and down, up and down. But the Steelers got to get touchdowns here. Bradshaw, and they got a Franco. Second and he gains four, it'll be second and six. My goodness. Again, Bradshaw, quick throw. They got to start with the first down and mark. Down to the 20, and it's down first to the 18, penalty. a penalty. And it's going to be defensive interference. They say no good. It'll be first down and 10. First and 10, and this is big. Bradshaw, a miser, nothing. It's going to be second and 10. Second down and 10, 5.02. Bradshaw, the sneak, they get third nothing. Down. And it's gonna be third and eight. This is where everything stalls. Bradshaw, third and eight. And they go to Blyer on the screen, he's short. Fourth down. And here out comes Terrell out again, it'll make it 14 to nine if he nails it. Terrell in the middle of the field. Roy Joella, not the best kicker in the world, missed a 30-yard field goal. And New England will take over. 344, Brady. Brady into the near side. Edelman, a first down. If they could go downfield, take a lot of this time up, that'd be big. Brady again. Oh, middle of the field, they got better than the first down, down to the 41. And they're getting big chunks now. First down, Brady now. They're really moving the ball. They got 
got to throw it every down. It'll be second and 11. Third down. Only about a gain of four, third and seven. Third down and seven. Brady. Again, incomplete. And now they got a punt. I don't know about 55. They're going to try it. It's going to be second down and ten. Nine seconds. Bradshaw's in his incompletion again. Franco. That's going to end the third. The end of the third quarter, the score. New England 14 and the Steelers 6. Feels like New England should be up more, but the Steelers made a couple good drives, but they couldn't finish it. One field goal and one missed field goal. The Steelers are two or three in field goals. Goskowski missed both, but they were long, long field goals. So we begin the fourth quarter here. I mean, my goodness. Third and five, Bradshaw incomplete again. Fourth down. Well, he picked a day. He picked one heck of a day to have a lousy day. It's fourth and five. And the punt. Can they yeah, knock it back to the nine? So 33 yards. It'll be first down for New England. 14-6. They lead by a four touchdown. Bennett. Second down. It'll be second and five. For New England, they want to use time. They would love to go down the field in 12 minutes and use everything. Brady. Brady's going to run, and Brady's going to get a first down. First down, so out of he's bounds. He's going to get a first down, an eight-yard gain off a scramble. And a first down for the Patriots, Brady. <laughs> he will throw, he will throw. and it's incomplete. incomplete second down. Second down. Second and ten. Fourteen to six. Brady. Incomplete there. Third down. I know they have a turnover. New England does. They went down the field. They fumbled it away. If they give one up now, that would be huge. Brady. He's going to run. Is he going to get it up? Brady. No. They're going to have to punt it. So under 13 to go. Allen will kick. And they'll kick it to the Steelers. So it's going to be to the 30 yard line. Field. to the 40. Down to the 49 yard line. The Steelers are going to get it here. A first down and 10. 12.44 to go. Bradshaw, horrible day today. He's going to throw again and incomplete again. Second down. He is having a bad day. It's going to be second down and 10. Bradshaw again to throw. He's throwing and it's incomplete. Third down. Oh, my goodness. Third down and 10. This could be three in a row. And Bradshaw, and he's running, he's sacked. Fourth he's down. sacked, and it'll be fourth down, and now they're going to punt. I mean, my goodness, the, there's a flag, and they're going to get, I think, two chances to punt. So it'll be returned to Amendola. And I think New England jumped off sides, and they did. And the Steelers are going to punt it again. Fourth down. Again. It's time to right down the middle of the field. 
Let's see, and the run line will get a lot on this. It's only a one yard return. And it's back to the 14 instead of up to the 30. First down for New England. Brady. Brady to the other way. Second down. Second down and 10. Second down and 10. Brady again. The Steelers aren't allowing a thing on the ground. It'll be third down and 11. Had he made it, but it's going to be fourth and 11 now. They're going to punt. I mean, back and forth we go. We're not even five minutes into the fourth. Allen will kick it. And here come the Steelers from the 35. Rudishaw up to the 43. They lose a little ground. It'll be first and 10. 10.21 to go. Bradshaw, they get a block. Second and 11. Nobody able to move the ball at all. Under 10 minutes to go. Bradshaw on the gun. Dakota Bryant on the inside. Third down. It'll be third down and six. So looks like this combination. I mean, they're aggressive defenses, and they can't throw down the field. He's got a move like a rookie go. Rookie's on the run down to the 28. He's down to the 29, a 24-yard gain, and that's big. Under nine minutes to go, 8.26 to go. Here's Bradshaw. The throw to Lynn Swan, and it'll be second, second down. down and seven. We had that weird interception with the Patriot running the wrong way earlier in the game. That was a fun blooper, Bradshaw. He throws the near side, incomplete, he was wide open. Penalty. There's a penalty, and let's see what it is. It's gonna be an ineligible receiver. And it'll be second down and 12, so they're gonna do it over again, Bradshaw. He pumps, he throws, Smith. Trying down. to get yards for Roy Jarella, but I wouldn't trust Jarella. Third down. I wouldn't trust him at all. Bradshaw. Bradshaw will run it himself. Bradshaw gets a first down and more. He scrambled and he gets a first down. Under seven minutes to go. Six and a half. Under six and a half. First down to Steelers. A pump. Uh, and completion over second down. If a field goal, if they kick a field goal, it's peg. If they score a touchdown, even bigger. Bradshaw. And they throw the wire. Nothing going. Third and down. another big third down. It'll be third and seven. Under six minutes to go. Chirella, five and a half. Bradshaw, and caught. Did he get enough? No, it's fourth and one. And Chirella will be trying a 26-yarder. 26 yards. He's got to make this. Chirella, and it is up and over. It looks good. And it is good. minutes and it's 14 to 9 and New England will have it so New England will take it here it's going to be deep they're going to run it out of the end zone Jones and look at Jones up to the 25 to the 26 first down and 10 let's see what New England can do Brady they dump it to Bennett all they need is first downs they could run out this clock really Second down and four. They're using all the time they can. A flag. And they move. They're going to move it back. So it'll be second down and nine. That was very big. Brady. And he goes to plow out to the outside. Nothing going. Well, only a gain of four. It'll be third and five. Big third and five. Three and a half to go. Brady. He's going to throw. He's going to throw. He got it. That's the only way they get a first down. Because you know that run defense will be up there. The Steelers might use timeouts here. 2.50 to go. They got to run two plays. There's Hogan. Second down. They're still throwing. It's second and eight. They need a first timeout, Steelers. So second and eight. Brady, they get the ball. Out to the near side. A humongous third and three. Huge third down and three. The Steelers call timeout again. Brady, a flag, and it's going to be encroachment and a first down. Well, the Steelers, I'll tell you what, the Steelers giving the game to New England. They just pretty much gave it to New England on that. First down and 10, 2.39 to go. Brady, and they got a loss. They only got a yard. It'll be second and nine. They're going to use the timeout, they will. They're going to go all the way to the warning now. Brady to throw, Brady to run, Brady. That's the football game. And they're going to take three knees 
and that's the football game. New England's gonna win 14 to nine. And that's warning. a two minute warning. Just look at the stats and we'll have the three knees. Patriots are going to win this one. They're going to take their knees, and that's it. There's one knee. Here's going to be. Oh, they can't get off the ground. Okay. Third down. Brady. Joe Green gets it. They got no timeouts. I thought he was going to return it all the way. I thought so. He was knocked down. Oh, no, they just take a knee and the game's over. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that was almost a miracle. Green picked it up. He couldn't get in. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Joe Green. He could have gone all the way. It would have been a miracle not in the Meadowlands, but... Oh my goodness, well they got a chance. 34 seconds, Bradshaw. <laughs> Nothing he goes out of bounds, and this is gonna be a miss. Just throw the Hail Mary. If you're the Steelers, just throw the Hail Mary. Don't even worry. Bradshaw, now in the middle of the field, incomplete. Third down. And they gotta throw the Hail Mary. They have to, they're doing nothing here, and they'll never do anything. Bradshaw. And he's going to go. He's going to go away. They're going to throw it deep. And if they get it, they get at least maybe one more. And it is incomplete. Fourth and they got down. one more down. Fourth and 17. So they got one more. Hail Mary. Will a miracle happen? Bradshaw, plenty of time. Oh, they're going to throw it. It's got to be in the end zone where time will run out. Incomplete. It's incomplete. And the Patriots survive. If Joe Green was faster, he would have gone all the way. But he didn't. Oh, my goodness. Oh, the miracle does not happen. And this time, Brady's going to take the knee. I don't know why they did that. I don't know. Ask Joe Pisarczyk. And the New England Patriots win 14-9. to Oh, my goodness. Quite frankly, um... Yeah, that's unbelievable. The ending. Um, just simply incredible. I, I don't think I've seen an ending. I've seen teams mess that up before. The last time I saw it was a championship game when the Rams, it was fourth down and three and they couldn't get the pass off. Quite frankly, and then what happened after that was just a, uh, it was, they, you know, messed it up, forced the Rams actually to punt, and the Hail Mary didn't work, and this one, the Hail Mary didn't work at all. Oh, my goodness, and that happened. Really, all game, it was New England with the absolute dominance. They played very well, and they ended up winning 14-9. So that's going to be it for today. For the most part, they couldn't put it in the end zone. They really couldn't run the football except for the fourth quarter. Tomorrow, the 86 Giants at the 07 Patriots. 86 New York at the 07 Patriots. So that's going to be it for us today. Almost a miracle, but it didn't happen. No miracle today. We're going to see you tomorrow.